How's it going everybody? So today I'm going to be bringing you a quick and easy tutorial on how to download and to use Wazel Pro for Windows. Now what you want to do here is go to your web browser, preferably Google, type in Wazel Pro and then click on the first link. Then you're going to want to hit register and enter some quick details about yourself including your email address. Now once you've hit register you will need to access your email address and confirm the email they send you. As you can see I have already done this so I straight away click sign in. Now once you've signed in and confirmed your address you want to go to download then you want to click on windows because that is what we're looking at today and then a little download box will appear in the bottom left corner. Now once it's installed it will have a little pop up, there we go, and then you want to click OK, Next, I agree, Install, wait for it to install, should take about 5 seconds, and then Next and Finish, and that should run the program. So now we want to close the web browser, and there we go, so now we're going to want to click on Sign In, and Sign In using our email address and password we created a second ago. Now you guys don't actually have to do this, but for the purpose of the video I'm just going to quickly show you how Wazel Pro actually changes your IP address once you have actually connected to their server. Well, if you did want to do this guys, you just go onto your browser, type in my IP, click preferably the first link and it will take you to this website on screen now. And this will show you your current IP address and your around about location. Then we want to go onto Wazel Pro select a server which is in your country or closest and simply click connect. Give it about a few seconds to connect and then you will see that it has actually given us a new IP address. Now to check this simply go back onto the web browser and refresh the page. There we go guys, so you can actually see it has changed our IP address to match the one on Wazel Pro. Thank you for watching guys, I hope this tutorial has been quick and easy for you. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below.